Welcome to our country. You've seen hard times, but for now you're safe. Everything's new here, and many things differ from what you're familiar with in your home country. We are aware that it's not easy to learn the rules, that is, how to behave, and to understand what's permissible and what's not. Maybe this short film will help us to coexist in a good way. We know that you've had to leave everything behind, with nothing in your bags but the utmost necessities. With these few things, you'll have to manage your daily existence and create a completely new life. That's hard, but possible, and there's much to help you along. You are among over 80 million people living in Germany. We are all different, yet we all want to get along peacefully. In order to achieve this, there are rules and laws that are binding for everybody. Coexistence is easiest if everybody is able to communicate. It's important that you learn our country's language, German. The first 19 articles of the German constitution, the Grundgesetz, define people's rights, that is, what we may and may not do. We are living in a democracy, meaning everybody is treated as equal. It also means that everybody has rights as well as duties. Article 5 of the Grundgesetz states that everybody has the right to express and share their opinions. Article 4 states that everybody may practice the religion they choose. In Germany there are churches, mosques, synagogues and other places of worship. Everybody who attends places of worship is free to do so and has to be respected. Those who do not believe in a god have to be respected too. No one may be discriminated against, neither by the state, nor by individuals or groups of people. Not because of their faith, the color of their skin, their age, gender, or because they are homosexual or handicapped. Women and men have equal rights. Like everybody else, you as a refugee have the right to seek state support, if you're being discriminated against or threatened with violence. To pursue your rights, you may hire a lawyer. Everybody has the right to live his or her life as he or she wishes. This may be cause for debate and, on occasion, conflict. Differences of opinion are something you will have to live with, as Germany is a plural society. Everybody may believe in something else, think differently, look differently, and love differently. This applies to everybody, including you. You are now part of this diverse society. Diversity is an advantage and a characteristic of life in Germany. Everybody in Germany may think and express themselves in their own way. However, you have to do this in ways that do not harm others, and you have to abide by the official rules and laws. Many things are new and different from your country of origin. In the beginning, some things may strike you as strange or incomprehensible. Contact and communication with others may help you understand. Just ask if there's things you want to know or you're not sure about. Also, tell others about yourself, as other people may profit from your experiences and views. German society tries to be open for change. You are now part of this society. Try to play an active part in it, and together with others, you may shape life in Germany. Everybody living here is part of German society. All those who respect the rules and laws have the right to participate and to shape our society. If you don't have German citizenship, you may not vote in federal or state elections. Some communities, however, grant you the right to vote in local elections. Elections are not the only way to participate in society. You can always join an association, an initiative, a political party, or any other type of organization. For example, you may join a sports club, you may participate in political rallies, voice your opinion freely, and look for allies in case you want to support certain issues. You are welcome to become an active part of your city or community and to participate in a state of peaceful and happy coexistence. You have the right, for example, to elect representatives in your temporary accommodation. You may also contact politicians and tell them about your troubles and issues and ask them for their support. You and your children have a right to education. In Germany, school attendance is compulsory, meaning parents have to see to it that their children go to school. Also, contact your local job centre to find out about opportunities for vocational training. You are now part of this society. Try to play an active part in it, and together with others, you may shape life in Germany.